Let's imagine the distance from your home to your school is 30 minutes and one fine morning you woke up just 15 minutes before your class starts. Have you ever thought that would you be able to reach your school just in remaining 15 minutes? Yes, the answer is yes. The answer is possible because of wormhole or Einstein's Rosen bridge. So what is stage that? It is a bridge from point A to point B in space time. Seems complicated, right? It is not. Let me tell you, if you are supposed to grow, go to your school from your home, what is the shortest path you would follow? You will open your door and then you will uh, follow a straight line from your home to your school. Just like, let's imagine, the point A is your home and this point B is a school. So if to go to your school from point A, you would follow a straight line, right? And it, it seems the shortest path. But what wormhole or Einstein's Rosen's bridge states that this straight line is not the uh, shortest path. There's a path shorter than this. What it would, what it would be? Let me tell you. Um, if you bend this paper like this, like this, so you would basically see that a point A and point B is point A and point B is closer than before. See, it's just this much. I can uh, see this is a point A and point B. This is a this is more closer than the straight line. So the bridge from point A to point B in space time that is here. This bridge is known as the wormhole or Einstein's Rodin bridge. Okay, so now you may all be thinking that the simplest path for, uh, to go from this point in real life to this point is a straight line. So how can we bend this air, right? Yeah, this question is obvious. But in reality, this point and this point, this straight line is not straight at all because Physics says that everything universe bends, the space and the time also bends due to gravity. So what we are seeing as a straight line is not straight at all, but it's a curved line. That means the space also curves due to gravity. So it's already curved like this. A point A and point B is already curved like this in space, but we're seeing it as a straight line because the space is bending due to gravity. So to go from point A to point B, we need a huge amount of exotic matter, a huge amount of energy to create a wormhole so that it connects a point A and B in another dimension, another bridge, A to B. See, there is nothing. And let's just prepare this space and there is nothing. We have to create a bridge from A to B to reach a point A to B from the shortest path. So how wormhole can be created? Uh, normally wormhole can be created with a huge amount of energy but it exists for a very small amount of time. Just 2 to 3 seconds and it is very small to create a huge amount of wormhole so that we can uh, go from a place to another point very far away from us with a huge amount of energy and an exotic matter. So basically, uh, with the help of wormhole, we can do interstellar travel. We can travel beyond our space, beyond our galaxies, which might take us millions, billions of light years if we are traveling through the conventional way, because uh, it's following the conventional path, conventional the curved path. But through wormhole, we're creating a bridge from point A to point B in space time, which is a straight line. So we'll be reaching the that very point very early. And another thing which I want to add is if we are creating a wormhole and we are traveling to the wormhole, we are basically a time traveler because light is also following the curved path of the space time. But wormhole isn't. If we are traveling from wormhole, we are reaching a point A to B, then the light, we are traveling faster than the light. So basically, we are doing a time travel. Uh, the concept of wormhole is also used in the movie Interstellar. Many of you have might seen the movie. Those who haven't, please do watch. It's a very interesting science fictional movie. Right. So by this point, you all have came to know that the wormhole is not, not just to go to your school from your home when you are getting up late from your bed. Right.